So what are the requisites of a bar graph? For a diagram to qualify as a bar graph, it must have these six properties. The first, it must have two axes, the vertical and the horizontal axes, also called the y and the x axes respectively. Number two, all bars should have equal width. And then number three, all bars should have equal space between them. Number four, the height of the rectangular bar should be equivalent to the data it represents. Number five, the bars must always be on a common base. And then finally, the bars can be drawn either vertically like we have here or horizontally like this. Easy peasy. Now, if you found this video useful and you want to support my efforts, be sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more interesting statistical videos like this. And if you want to learn about the different types of bar charts, check out this video here. And if you want to learn more about the elements of multiple bar charts, check out this other video right here. And as always, thanks for watching.